Now, the only information I could get from the Kents was the earth-shattering admission that Clark hates Pete. Chloe, a body part shows up at the talent, and all you can do is talk about Clark. Where are your priorities? You know Lex Luthor must be mixed up in this somehow. Easy. You know, I know you've got issues with the Luthers, More but... than issues. You know what the Luthers did to my family. Okay, one piece of investigative information at a time. Now, about Clark. Chloe, what do you want from me? In a world full of designer water, Clark Kent is straight from the tap. I know, but you've known him the longest. I mean, all I need is just like a little anecdote, just a small piece of information from Clark's deep, dark past. Well, there was something back in the first grade. Thank you! It's more than I've uncovered in like the past two days. Now, please, let's continue. There was this bully three grades ahead of us. This dude was determined to pound dents into every kid in the school. One day, I guess it was my turn. He's just about to take my head off when Clark jumped between us. So Clark ran interference. Now, as kind as that sounds, Reed, I really don't think it falls into the something amazing test. What test? I'm not finished. Clark didn't just push Brain Did away. He put him through a door, as in splinters and broken hinges. How we did it, I still have no idea. Guy was at least twice our size. Clark, any comments? Uh, well, we were, you know, six years old. Twice our size was three feet tall. If you need any more ancient history, ask the source. I've got an appointment at the student's door. <laughs> have fun. And so the mystery that isn't Clark Kent deepens. Mystery? Yeah. Since you've continued to play obstructionist, I've had to find information through other means. For instance, I found that your adoption was done through Metropolis United Charities. But this is the strange part. They were only in business for six months. And from what I can tell, yours is the only adoption they handled. I can't believe you did this, Chloe. You didn't know? I just assumed that your parents would have told you. I mean, weren't you interested? Why would I be? My biological parents are either dead or didn't want me. The point is you're prying into my private life. She's trying to be thorough. This is a class project. I spent an hour yesterday with Lana. That's it. It's all I needed. I'm not some mystery for you to solve. Clark, I, 